Skunk Lifestyle, we are going again. Alright, fams, today's episode different. Good vibes, good energy. Yo, we're linking up with our link. My dad's like that. Top Lodge, James Leckler, you don't know the vibes. He invited me out today to take some pulls in the 2019 G-Wagon, the G63. This was actually the first G63 of the new ships that came into the island. So you know the vibe lifestyle, we're going to go for a little pull. So the dads you know. Top oh Lodge God. himself, we're going, bro. We're going there, you know. So yo, tell me what we're going for today. Just a quick vibe. So, you know, we're both busy people. So we had to just throw something together quick. I go run Palisados. Feel the engine a little bit, not too fast. Yeah. And then, you know, check out the go kart track and then we're back. Mad. Big up. So I'm going to show you the car right now, Pam. This is it. You see that lifestyle? Big fat G Wagon, you know, like this is actually one of my favorite SUVs. James probably didn't know that. No, I didn't. Yeah, so I it's didn't. actually one of my favorite um, trucks. And trust me, one day, James and I could get one of them, isn't it? Yeah. So. You know the vibes, lifestyle, look you like ready pretty. For us to open it up? Yep, yeah, sure. Let me hear it. I want to hear the cold start and stuff on it too. Right. Okay. They lock them serious. Oh the, yeah. the, the activator them. Oh oh the the activator them. Solid. Slam. When you lock it, you all have to slam it. Yeah. Yes, lifestyle. See them now. Nice interior. Yo, what thing I love about Benz, I tell people all the time, Benz interior is like one of the best. So. I'm going to show you the exterior again quickly. Don't play with this bad zine. Big boy motor right there. And this color is very unique. I think yes. possibly the only color in the island, this one. Yes, this is the only one in the island and no more no more of this color will be sold. You know what I mean? Let's get the cold start quickly. Section of the G stands so I won't even go YouTube it or Google it. So yeah, what does the G in G wagon stand for? You know? Gallus. So yeah, what does the G in G wagon stand for? You know? Gallus. <laughs> I mean, it's a gangster, is it? <laughs> what, what, what you say? I, I say Gallus, but you say gangster. But so, the both of them then. You know what I was thinking? This kind of look like how your girl is supposed to look in a few years. Yeah, it's going to look like this one day, definitely. The big G with the poison. Lord, yeah, you know, you know, loving all brands, right? Yeah, yeah. Brands. you have to. You know what I realize? Even though I work with specific brands, we're in 2022. Um, all cars are good cars nowadays, isn't yeah. me? It's just your preference on what you like. But nowadays, all cars are good cars. You know, I respect that. But mine are the best. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, because I mean, at the end of the day, you're selling good brands. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, if you guys need anything like a Mercedes, yeah, come down to still It's four and a half South Camp Road. We have Suzuki, Mitsubishi, Benz. Jaguar Land Rover, Range Rover, we have a Honda bike. If you need Baco, we got Baco, JCB, come out. So everything from bike to bulldozer, you know. <laughs> Dog, yo, yo, you're born for this, you know. Yeah, man. And from tell them about the um, the electric vehicle. Yeah, so we actually started two new brands last December. One is called Great Wall Motors. That's our wicked um, value brand. When you need more bang for your buck, mm -hmm. that's down at South Camp Road. And now we're also doing BYD. Build your dream. We're gonna talk about that till we're ready for bus stop. Ah. Right? Yeah, so yeah, lifestyle. Let me just give you a quick look on the interior right now. Ah, look on it now, lifestyle. Such a nice interior, like timeless. It's a very timeless interior right here that you're looking at. And some people don't understand the value of this vehicle. You know, it has a very old school look to it with a modern touch. So 
your lifestyle while recording a while ago I didn't realize that it actually has dual exhaust on both sides like that's sick like it's pretty much like a fighter jet this is mean you have exhaust coming out left and right side of the vehicle so yo we're gonna go for a little pulling right now yeah, have a chit chat with James because James is a very entertaining person <laughs> You're going to tell me about your channel, what we're doing on your channel yeah. and all of that type that, of stuff And we're just all the vibes together That James? sound good, we could go Let's go, we go Jeez, some peace yeah. Can I see if you can move sir? Yeah man huh? I feel like I just sit down and start wheeling yeah. I love that when the back just sit down But you make mom's heart catch a feeling you know Yeah with them Big up, to, big up to Jackie as well and yes. the entire Stewart's team Thanks man Thanks Ma. for allowing us to get this nice beautiful machine to get a great review on it today so James guess, let's get back to your channel because I want to, I want them to know what you're, you're about I'm the baddest white boy of Jamaica right now man tell you James full of, full of energy you know so can't disagree tell me what's going on now so on your channel you know sir channel is top lodge mm -hmm. named that after the hunting because right. a lot of that we love to hunt fish so the channel is just about the lifestyle, you know, and yeah. we do, what we do on our weekends, in our free time, what we do on our daily. I just try to cover everything and it's all about fun, mm -hmm. good people, good vibes. What, 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 what kind of gave you inspiration to get into it? Well, boy, that deep, you know, um, I have a mentor who really helped me out a lot with getting my life on track and thing. Um, and we had some plans to maybe film some shows and thing. Yeah. And when he got murdered, I said, oh. yeah, so you know, would I really love just, would I really love do this in his honor, in his yeah. memory? Because just because I'm gone, don't mean I can give up on the plans and all them things. So Definitely. That really inspired me a lot. I'm well, sorry to hear that though, bro. Yeah, respect, you know. That's all. In life, go. Mm -hmm. Every, everybody does a dropout. Definitely. What about you? What inspired you to do the car thing? Um. You know, yo, yo, that's crazy. He's asking me a question on my <laughs> vlog, which is good. Um, but pretty much, I got into this because of my brothers. You know. Okay. You know, um, basically grew up in grew up being around cars. Yeah. And found that I had a passion for it. And passion is not something that you. Sometimes you can develop it, but I realized that this passion was inborn. Mm -hmm. So it's just something that I've just been working with, and then Dre. Because I usually do Skunk Nation before But what got me into personalized vlogging Like you know sharing a little bit about my daily life and stuff like that mm. Was my brethren Barrington, Dre, you see me of Cardia Media yeah. He was like yo why don't vlog? And I said what is vlogging? So I didn't know anything about vlogging okay. I never know vlogging was just like you know I'm just doing your stuff every day You're just so, filming what you're doing? Yeah and then when we got into it and stuff like that You know how the vibes go already Trust me now Yeah <laughs> in, you know the vibes, big up to the youth, them in the streets, isn't me? You know, so it's crazy because I never know any of this uh, way, way back when I, when I when I started last year. Yeah. My partner is Dre. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah, Yo, man. Barrington, one of the realest. He, yeah, man. Big he's up who to makes, Dre. He's who makes Top Lodge even exist. So big up my partner. Mm -hmm. So that's how we got started. You know what I mean? We got to look at this rock to the wall ago. And. <laughs> To be honest with you, it has been a good journey as well and you're going to find that once you start growing in your subscription mm -hmm. and your fan base, you're going to find how, how more motivated you are to do it. Because yeah. when people say, boy, they love your work and they rate your work, it push you. Yeah. You know? Lot, at first I thought YouTube, like, we had the idea, I said, yo, this um, it's kind of easy. Mm -hmm. This guy just, just film a video and put it out. No. You learn a, a lot of work. Yep. It's, it's a lot of work, it's a lot of production, creativity as well because to create content isn't as easy as what people expect it to be. Mm -hmm. You know, even like this, yeah. look, I was supposed to link him from this morning, from yeah. we went on the road last night. Yeah. This young man here, tell me, say, I'm all the vibes in it, man. You see? Woo! Listen to that. V8, you know. It's just sweet, don't it? Yeah, man. V8 by Turbo. When? It's crazy. When you're just going on a Sunday, a Sunday drive out, and yeah. you just hear the engine, it's almost as nice as driving the car itself. And we have done a vlog with James' uncle as, as well, Uncle Duncan. Yes. I mean, you grew up around Uncle Duncan. What is it like growing up around him? Because he's such a legend in the motorsport scene. So driving wise, that's what. Um, I'm yeah, no, crazy. So 
driving is just in in the family yeah so my grandfather would have been one of the people who helped start rally in jamaica okay. he's one of the pioneers in the automotive industry yep after him racing while they're racing there's no roll cage no nothing okay um and then also rally cars I used to have a red stripe 1000 yeah which ran from st thomas to montego bay i've been told right crazy things then my uncle he came next and he was known for two things either coming first or not finishing because he would have crashed yeah flat out yeah yeah that's a, that's the motto all right my mother who's lent us this car she actually used to race as well oh really and she used to navigate i never know that yeah big up big up tanti jockey right there all right me. right now in this generation my cousin Timmy, T Stew, big yeah, up. Big up Timmy. He's big up Timmy. Wicked rally driver. Yeah. All different kind of thing, the man bad bro. He was big in the go-karting. Yeah. Um, from my recollection, it was always him or Kyle right. coming first and second in the go-karting. Right. Um and it's just continued. They've now let me start driving. So that is fun. I yeah. drive a lancer. I've no clue what I'm doing, but I just want to go fast. Yo, tell them about your experience. You just started playing football. Tell them about oh. football. Yeah, you know, so I get old now, turned 28 last week. I'm going to say, yo, we need to start to be fit. We need to get active. So I've been playing ball. Now take up what you can do. <laughs> For, broke up my hand, can't use my left hand right now. Yo. My toe are dropping. Look what's wrong with my left hand. Bro, things swell up. Yeah. I don't even know if you can see, but it's. <laughs> hand worthless right now Yo, I, this is so crazy shit. not even the goal yeah, I mean I use my hand up the hell yeah. my toe I drop out I don't know if Tony will drop out people <laughs> yo speaking of that bro I was talking to Drizzy Burt this morning I want to carry six I want to meet six I would love to meet six yeah the videos are funny yeah man I want to meet six bro six is hilarious you know I just love everybody and yeah and that's what I will say about you bro you have a very um, welcoming personality and very humble and down to earth because you know what I want to also share with people on the vlog as we speak today is that not because somebody might tend to say boy white or Chinese or whatever uptown no love or love you understand I always share respect no matter your age your race or where you yeah. come from yeah, wrong so, I'm right you know you're right you just have to treat people good good as long as you know the one thing that makes me sad about Jamaica right now are the bad mind yes out and of crime. control yeah and the crime yeah you know just, we just need to try to live good with each other but Tell the viewers as well that even though crime exists, Jamaica still nice. Why yeah. why you don't find yourself wanting to migrate? Boy. And why has your fam why why hasn't your family decided to leave Jamaica? We look we've been here a long time and Jamaica is our home. We're not going nowhere. Mm. Our goal, our mindset is why leave when you can try fix it. Ah. So you know, in the last bef before COVID things were going well the charity was doing well um, I think led by my sister Christina right. big up big up Christina um, she actually organized we built seven basic schools in seven years Whoa. all across the island really Currently, that's good big yeah, up big up we donated for a covid ward um, during covid I think she is heading up a to build a maternity ward down nice. in Port Antonio. Nice, so, because those places lack these, mm -hmm. infa these facilities. It's, me? It's, a, our, our, it's from my grandmother. She's brought it down. She's always been giving. So mm -hmm. even if you guys go through Grand Spend and you see that lovely community center, yeah. my grandmother was the head of that. Nice. Um, it's just, you have to give back. If you're blessed to receive, you need to give back to other people. You hear that lifestyle? Yo, listen, two words in them, bro. Two words, trust me when I tell you that. Two words. Yeah, it met me. It met me and he asked why we don't want to leave. This place sweet, nothing sweet like yeah. Nothing sweet. The people, when you find good Jamaicans, you find good people. True. When you talk about good food, could I take me to a million dollar restaurant in Miami? I just want a box lunch. I'm hungry. Hear that? Just, uh, fried chicken in the curry gravy. Touch it. Oh, God. You hear that lifestyle? That's what I'm telling you, say, yo, the youth are one of the realest youth them right now when my, when my forward cross. And we recently start pouring more. And trust me, we're going to do some camping trips. So I'll yeah. we'll link up with Drizzy them. Because yeah. Drizzy them and, and James will make a good team <laughs> because them love, them love nice, them like, like nice women, you know. You understand? <laughs> and them type of vibes. Eh? Nothing wrong with that. That's not the vibes. Not wrong at all. You understand? So we're going to do something like that. But I'll close out this segment now because we don't want to make it too long and drawn out. You got to know.
James a little bit more. Big up lifestyle. You need to follow his channel, Top Lodge. Yo, I'm gonna leave it in the description bar. You know the lower. When I said bottom, right? No, lower. Low, yeah, when I go around there. All right, so I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna follow him. He's he's poised to be a very big YouTuber in Jamaica. Once him stay consistent. Yeah, man. We post every Sunday without fail. All right. So anything at all, him post and I show a little piece. I'm like. Sure, today's video going up. Mad. So yo, subscribe, post. guys. Beg you. I know you're already following one of the baddest channel out there. Respect. Beg you, subscribe. We just try and do this for you guys. You see me? Definitely. So I'm gonna give you some pulls in the car now and good vibes, and we're getting back to the G wagon. You see me? things coming out so as soon as I get access to them I'd love to have you come by and pre them yeah man new GLC coming this year sweet can't wait to get getting that. any electric vehicles for, for, for Mercedes this year or no I'm hoping that in there's 20 EQC or something like that. there's EQC EQA EQB EQE and EQS both sedan and SUV um, so I'm hoping to get electric vehicles next year yeah for Benz but we have the electric brand we're going to bust them on and we actually sell we've sold a few jaguars nice. I, the i pace yeah, yeah yeah sweet yeah i know that the commissioner the british yeah commissioner has one, so right? there's a few more and they're all like nice spec good interior it's a big engine so i think it's zero to 60 or zero to 100 kilometers in about 4.5 seconds well you know let's expand on the electric market how do you feel about it being in the car sales for you know growing up in it you know, um, it's one of the potential futures if we're going towards a green, a whole, a whole green type of energy saving environmental production. Right. There's still a few problems. So producing the batteries is not environmentally friendly. Getting rid of them after the car is done is not environmentally friendly. However, it's still better than the current carbon emissions. Okay. I honestly believe if they ever sort out how to um, make a safe hydrogen car yeah that will be the future um but right now electric is it and yo some of them are wicked you saw the tesla hold on what you said some of them most of them are like crazy <laughs> well, the zero to 60 on them carry well, i saw some them. of them like the nissan leaf and thing well look they're good cars yeah it's not exciting for me no. to switch from a big engine but like the tesla the plaid all of that Oh sweet. Oh, I love the platter right now. Trust me. Alright. Nice. Yes. Ready? Yeah man. SUV, a truck, this thing is awesome and it, you know, it comfortable, you know. Sweet. Very. And so that's actually, a, there's a big reason why, you know, most SUVs get someone drop 22s on there. 
we went with the twenties because it makes it more sense for Jamaica. You have a more comfortable ride, yeah, and also you get a thicker tire, right. so you're more more likely to be okay if anything happens. Patrol and yeah. Something, yeah. We have stop at the go kart track. Yeah, yeah. Let's right. go. Give them a link and then you can ride them. Yeah. Woo! And this thing has natural burbles lifestyle, isn't it? Natural burbles. Yeah, lifestyle. So you don't know the vibe. Motorsports in our vein, you know. So let's walk around, give you guys a quick look at what's happening out here. This wasn't planned, but because we wanted to take a run with the G Wagon, I decided to say, oh, here are James. Make could just take a look at what's happening out here today. So the karting associations, I think today is one of the race meets, so you don't know the vibe. <laughs> How's today? Today's a race meet, right? Yeah. Oh, 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 He's going to try the double apex. One. Okay. The door is shut. Second and fourth is and third is one. Yeah. What, what, what you love most about? How, how does it make you feel? The game isn't over yet. It made me feel so good and when I first started, like um, about five years old, the, the, when I got in the cart, I just step on the gas and it just fly and now it's the really perfect time to, to get it. Yeah. And, and it's so good and today the is running. knocking on the door hard. What's your That's name? Her second David Bow. Secondly, you can see me one day and get a little breather. One on it. And I'm a big fan. <laughs> Yeah, where are you, bro? Yeah, well, I think that was the last race of the day, and they just finished. Tommy won. Big up, Tommy. You've been teaching me enough at the rally thing. Yeah. Just slacker there. Slacker. Big up. Oh, yeah, sir. You good? Yeah, man. Everything good? Yeah, man. Him cart just win. Yeah, complete. My cart just win. Yeah. yeah. cart just win one ago. Yeah. Nice. I'll just give you guys a look at the cards so you can you know, have an idea. Yeah man, big up to the team. Big up, big up, big up. You don't know the vibe. These are the peeps behind the scenes making it work. You don't know these are the go-karts lifestyle. So these are good training ground for kids and even even adults that need to like shape up on them skin. You know, we can't walk past the sponsor them and big them up. Now, big up to Amza and you know, shit. So, yeah, well, we're going to talk to Tommy right now. Sarah, yeah. what's up? How was it a while ago? I'm half dead. I forgot how much work I think it's. I eat her, man. Don't worry, So, Tommy is um, actually a dog bird son. He just won a while ago, right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Not by much. Not by much. Okay, hi, so. huh? <laughs> Give me a card. It's because this one went and crashed into me in the first race. Really? <laughs> Nothing goes. Which I passed you and f***ing <laughs> hold it. <laughs> Yo, that's a competition in there. Yeah, yeah, man. Speed, you know. Alright. Lifestyle, I told you, it was just like a quick run in, you see me? You don't know, we're on top of your head back to Kingston now and probably get like one and few other pulls 
Okay. And then you don't know, close out the segment here of the vlog. This this look this is obvious? Um hold on, what you say? This look obvious? Wait, you're talking about the black and blue haircut yeah. or you're talking the skin? <laughs> Not much obvious man. <laughs> Yo, the man take up when can manage you. Can hurt. Thank God the race today get cancelled. Yeah. But I'll be there one hand and crash in on everything. <laughs> yeah, lifestyle, so let's go. I believe it's like 3.6 seconds or something. Okay. Can I can't always can do a little quick book like So this is the home. Yeah. Right here. But it's a couple of water. Give them the water of dry water. Yo, the thing does not take on the road, so man. Sweet. Yeah, man, it's sweet. Che, man. Che, yo, we're going on nice SUV on Jamaican roads with a big engine. It makes you know, it makes you know a real, a real drive in Jamaica is like. Yeah. Sports car, yeah. them sweet. But you can only really enjoy that on the highway. And smooth roads there. Yeah. And there's hardly any smooth roads really. <laughs> Not even on the highway. Also, no, yeah, the lifestyle, you know, the vibe. I'm going to close out this segment now. Big up to James again. Big up to the entire Stewart's Auto Sales team. Auntie Jackie, respect again. Uncle Duncan is here, man. Say. Big up again. Top logic. Big up. Self. Like, share, and subscribe. We're out on bad. Mad. Well,